did you know that if you have been denied boarding due to an overbooked flight and haven't been provided an alternate flight within one hour, you are entitled to compensation. You could receive up to 200% of the booked one-way basic fare along with airfare fuel charges up to a maximum of Rs 10,000. Furthermore, in the case of a delay extending beyond 24 hours, a compensation of up to Rs 20,000 must be paid. If the airline arranges an alternative flight schedule departing more than 24 hours from the originally scheduled departure, passengers may be eligible for an even higher compensation. This could amount to up to 400% of the booked one-way basic fare along with the airline fuel charges with a maximum cap of Rs 20,000. These are liable only in cases where the traveller is holding a valid ticket and has presented it on time. Let's understand how these compensation rules work. In this case, if the airline successfully arranges an alternative flight for you within one hour of the original scheduled departure time, you cannot hold the airline responsible for any compensation related to the missed original flight. If the alternative flight is arranged within 24 hours of the original flight departure, an amount of up to Rs 10,000 has to be paid as compensation by the airline. Now, what if the alternative flight is scheduled beyond 24 hours of the original departure? In this case, you have the right to claim compensation of up to Rs 20,000 from the airline. Lastly, if you choose not to opt for an alternative flight at all, the airline is obligated to refund the full value of your ticket. Additionally, they must provide compensation equally to 400% of the booked one-way ticket fare plus the airline fuel charge with a maximum limit of Rs 20,000. Now, how long do you have to wait for the refund? If you made a cash payment to purchase your air ticket, here's the good news you can expect to receive your refund immediately. However, if you used a credit card for your payment, the process might take up to 7 working days. Now, let's move on to flight delays. According to the DGCA, if the delay is for less than 24 hours from the scheduled departure, you are entitled to meals and refreshments at the airport. If it exceeds 24 hours, you should be provided with hotel accommodations and transfers. However, the choice of hotel is up to the airline. 